In other news, Minneapolis is celebrating a major accomplishment when it comes to a service thousands of people use every day. It is now the first major city to eliminate a potentially harmful chemical from all of its dry cleaners. Mary McGuire joins us now live from Minneapolis with more on the city's mission to eliminate this particular chemical. Mary? Well, Ali, this uh, chemical that we're talking about is a difficult word to say. It's called perchloroethylene. It's more commonly known as perk, and it's used to dry clean clothes like the ones you see behind me. It's easy to see, though, why people are concerned about it. It's known to cause cancer, and now it's been eliminated from every Minneapolis dry cleaners. Perk is the main solvent used in dry cleaning businesses across the country, but today, Osmond Cleaners in Uptown became the last business in the city to become entirely perk free. Mayor Jacob Fry Council members and environmental officials were on hand to celebrate the removal of the last two barrels of this chemical this morning. It's a concern for the city's health department because the EPA has classified it as a likely carcinogen. It also has the potential to damage organs and affect reproduction and fetal development. Our biggest concern with PERC is the exposure in the, in the facility, is that can be 100 to 1,000 times higher than it is, or 10,000 times higher than it is in the outdoor air quality. Now, this, these new perk-free machines are not cheap. They run about $100,000. The cleaners is getting some help paying for it through a variety of grants, though. Now, I did ask the owner of this dry cleaning business if this would have any impact on the price it would cost customers to come in here and get their clothes dry cleaned. He said he doesn't expect it to impact uh, the prices, though, here, Allie. Good to know. Mary, thank you.